Hello and welcome everyone to another exciting episode of the Super Calling Gaming Pokemon X Nuzlocke Challenge Day 2. Let's do it. Okay, so uh, last episode we caught ourselves our first new friend, Tarth the Pidgey. Woo! Oh, and what a powerhouse Tarth is. Look at that level 3 tackle. Oh, man. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. That is wonderful. Bashful. Okay. And then uh, we have a gentle nature for uh, X, which, how, that's interesting. Gentle. Okay. Character is capable of taking hits. That's right. You know it. X. Bam. Uh, let's see. So if you look at the stats, it looks like we're going to have a higher. I always mix up which one is good and bad. You'd think the one in blue would be the one you're getting the boost on, and the one in red is the one you're getting hit on. But I think it's the reverse. I think we're going to get extra special defense. And sadly, we might have a lower defensive hits. So we'll have to keep that in mind. But uh, today, we're going to head into Santa Loon Forest. And uh, we're going to catch probably a couple new friends, going to fight some trainers, and get a little bit of uh, training done. But let's, no, 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 nothing else to do. Let's go ahead and just start the journey. Uh, I don't know if we'll get all the way through to the first year today. Hold on. Oh, hi, Big J. Also, just as we're recording this, I know in the last episode I asked you guys, what should we do about uh, these two's names? Because Shauna and Serena, psh, pretty lame names. Obviously, they should be called some sort of silly food. But uh, as we're recording, the first episode has not been released yet. Yes, so I don't have your suggestions yet. I'm sure they were all hilarious, though. I can't learn how to catch Pokemon. Nope. I already did it. I already did it. I already did it. Don't need your help. Okay, cool. It's cool. It's fine. What'd you run into? Is it good? A Bonobi. That probably would have been more fun. I, it's so annoying when you like open a brand new game. I remember that even the first time I played X and Y, I got to the first patch of grass and I was like, what am I going to catch? And it was a Pidgey. And you're like, come on. What am I? Is this the first game I've ever played? Uh, no. Unfortunately, I quickly caught a, a Fletchling after that. That would be fun. I would, I would not mind having a Fletchling on the team. Actually, when I caught Fletchling, I think I... Uh, I think I didn't realize it was a fire type out of the gate. I thought, oh, this is just the, the tiny bird for this game. And uh, then later on, it, I think I ended up like three fire types in my first playthrough of this game because I didn't realize. And then I think I had picked Charmander when you get to pick your Pokemon later on. So I had two like fire flying types. Yeah, that's what happened. Wow, the Pokemon went inside the Pokeball. What? You, you act like you've never seen a Pokemon before, Shauna. Jeez. Okay, we got Pokeballs. Oh, I already got some anyway. I, I like bought them last time. I think I'm a little bit better at this than you guys, but... <sighs> Serena, we'll put up some good fights. Here I go. Sorry, I'm yawning. No good. Sure, you can catch Pokemon right here. Just throw a Pokemon at them. Okay, blah, 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 blah. Okay, it's fine. Cool, see ya. All right, let's go. Yay, Pokemon. What's it gonna be? What's it gonna be? We can't catch it. Ah, see, we might have got a Bunnelby. But we didn't. We can't catch this because we already caught the Pidgey on this route. But we'll go ahead and knock it down with some bubbles. Because, you know, level 2 Bunnelby. I don't think so. Diggersby, I think, is one of the creepier looking Pokemon ever. He's got that weird grin going all the time. Yeah! Ba-boom. I do like in this game, they did change so that when you catch Pokemon, you still get experience. Which is, uh, I think, the first... I think this was the first game to introduce that. Which is nice. <gasps> A scatter ball! Oh man, that could have been our first Pokemon too. Je man, ah, level two Scatterbug would have been a little tricky, but nonetheless, um, I love Scatterbug. Well, I like Vivalon a lot. I think it's a really cool Pokemon. I like it. You can have like 16 different forms or something. That's kind of crazy. Level seven, or at least like appearances, which is neat. So if you're like a big time shiny hunter, that's probably like really impossible to get all the different Vivalons. But here we go. Uh, into, I think this is going to be our first trainer fight. This kid in the hoodie thinks he's tough. Huh? <laughs> when two trainers' eyes meet, a Pokemon battle must begin. Those are the rules. Never make eye contact with anybody. Youngster Austin sent on a Zigzagoon. Zigzagoon. Boy, that would have been a disappointing first Pokemon. I bet they're nearby. Here we go. Here we go. Ba boom. Bubble, 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 bubble. Swing the axe. Oh, level five. Use tackle. 
You dare harm Axe. That's okay. As we just learned, Axe can take a hit. I feel like that has like two layers, like can take a hit and doles out the hits, like with uh because because of the sharp blade at the end of the axe, you know. Doot, doot, doot. You should have told me you were that strong, but I didn't realize. Oh no. Yeah, you should have realized. Look at this, I'm like a foot taller than you, dude. And I've had Pokemon for like six minutes now, so yeah, pretty impressive. Here we go. Santa Loon Forest. Doot, 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 doot. Oh, what's that? Wait up, let's walk together. I feel like, huh. I'll heal your Pokemon wherever you want me to. Great, I want you to. Want me to heal your Pokemon, Big J? Okay, I'm on it. Oh boy, thank you. It's actually super nice having her because then you don't have to like, it makes it easy to train these first couple Pokemon you get. But speaking of which, it is time to catch a new Pokemon, the Santaloon. Oh boy, let's go get that item first. Or, oh god, if we go on the grass, a little bit nervous, what's it gonna be? I really want it to be a scatter bug. I don't know why, I always love those like early bug type Pokemon. Oh, potion, okay. All right, let's do it, let's do it. I think there's three monkeys are in here. I think even Pikachu, oh here it is, this is it. What's it gonna be? <gasps> it's a Weedle, it's a Weedle. All right, all right. Weedle it is, Probably level two Weedle at that. All right, okay. Um, do I even have to hit it? Should I hit it? That's the question. Can we just throw a poke? We'll just throw a ball at it. Here we go. What an exciting Pokemon. Beedrill, Beedrill. Bing! Yay, we got it. Okay, cool. Let me write it down. So just make a record. As I said, we don't quite have people leaving comments yet, sadly. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna go into the uh, cross country team section of our Discord and just sort of maybe pull from there because those uh, people are supporters of the gaming channel on Patreon. That seems like a good place to pull it from. Okay, I like that, that's a funny name. We're going with Dar because that's how I feel about catching this Weedle right now. And that is named after uh, Darren extrapolated from spoons. So there you go. Welcome Darren Dar to the team. <laughs> what a great name. What a great name. <laughs> Dar. All right. Uh, should we actually train something else? I mean, I don't mind having a Beedrill around. That's for sure. Uh, switch, go. Or a Pidgeot, I mean, it's fine. I don't think either of these is gonna be like big mainstay members of the team at any point, but f uh, what are we, what's it gonna be? Oh, look at this, it could've been, a, I mean, Panpour is still not, we already have a water type, so it's probably better that we didn't even get that, but, you know, as it were, as it were. Come on, Axe, come on here and pound this Panpour. That was a weird sentence. Let's do it, let's do it. It's gonna be fun getting the new axe here. Um, when's the last time we had a water Pokemon? Was it Ozzy? Man, I really, I feel like the fact that Luke picked uh, axe for us puts on a lot of pressure for it to be real. Like, I really wanna make sure <laughs> axe doesn't, as if I'd ever want my starters to die. But um, the, only, the only starter I think that's ever made it through the Elite Four was uh, the Mighty Flow, the Sceptile. And uh, all the rest have died, so it's not it's not like a guaranteed position. Although I think as starters go, um, Froki is one of the better ones in general, as it's at, like compared to its game. I don't know; I've never actually played through with it. Thirty six, boom, yeah, level eight, go axe. No, 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 halfway to evolving. Axe learned cook attack. Oh, that's cool. Yay, I like. Dark to level three, yay, Dar! <laughs> Marty having fun saying that guy's name. Hey, yeah, heal, heal me. Do it, Shauna. I want you to do it. Yeah, okay, I'm on it. Yay! Let's see what we got. What we got? I bet we can get to. Uh, oh, it's a big. Look at all the Pokemon we might have caught that weren't Weedle. We could have had a Pikachu. Oh my god. Are you guys excited for the Detective Pikachu movie? Because I am definitely going to run from this Pikachu. 
I think. I don't know what it has. I do not want it to unleash some sort of weirdly powerful thunder shock onto Axe, though. That would be no good whatsoever. We don't want to be hit with thunder shocks when we're this low level. We cannot risk any sort of weird death. Which. Oh, actually, I'm. A, we, this is actually. This is a great reason to make sure that we are um, training something besides just. Uh, axe because guaranteed if pan pour is here so is pan sage wow this would be a really long fight and if pan sage is here that would give them the type advantage and we don't want that we don't want any early game weird type we don't have any like backup really you know that being said both tarth and uh dar could pretty easily Am I really gonna sit here and I really, I'm not even sure if it's worth, I'm sorry, that was just a waste of a battle. Both of them would be good against grass types. So, we should bear that in mind. Do 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 do, Santaloon Forest, huh? Yeah. What, you wanna fight a battle? No, Tierno, I wanted to fight that dude. I don't want you to fight him. Jeez. Caterpie, okay, I mean. I don't know. I don't know. Caterpie Weedle, pretty much the same. I don't know if I like Butterfree or Beedrill more than the other. I really wanted the Vivalon, though. Ugh, such a... Uh, such a bug. Can we... Does Poison Sting do more to you? It probably does, because you're not a Poison type. Just... Tink! Yeah. Oh, my God. So slow. Can we do the whole fight? Oh, we're going to hit with String Shot. That's going to be lame. Just... Oh, it's so slow. I'm sorry, you guys. Maybe... I'm just going to sit here and fight this. And Derek can speed the rest of it up. Or maybe it's... No, oh, there it is. Okay. Uh, string shot. These early parts. These early parts. I want to get to the point where we can catch another Pokemon that isn't something you could have caught as a starter Pokemon in <laughs> uh, red and blue. Like, all we have so far is a Weedle and a Pidgey. It feels like... Like, it does feel like you're playing through uh, Fire Red or something. Which is a little bit silly. There we go. I'm so, man, these level two Caterpie fights. This is where the action's at. Oh, we didn't even get a level out of it. It's so boring, ugh. Hey, heal my, we, hey, 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 yeah. You had one job. No, no, what, what are you doing? Stop slowing me up. I love puzzles, so I watch everything more closely than you might think. <sighs> Great, thank you so much. Yes, the Paralyzed Heal is wonderful. Let's go. Hey, you. Want to fight? You want to fight? You've got a, a scatterbug? I like scatterbugs. Youngster Joey. Do do do. Yay. Okay. We're definitely just going to switch out and uh, let Mighty Axe destroy this little scatterbug. That's what's happening. Go, Axe. <sighs> we'll see. Gentle nature, but capable of taking a hit. That is an interesting combination of characteristics. Like, he's not, like, trying to get into a fight. Like, it sounds like he doesn't like resorting to violence, but indeed, you know, if you push him too far, look out. Like, I'm very gentle, very passive, very just like, hey, hey, it's cool, it's cool. Is there a, is there a um, non-violent solution to this? There's not. Let's go. Dark level four. Let's get Fletchling. Oh, this thing's so going down. Eat bubbles. Eat bubbles! Brah. Yeah, you're dead. There you go. Boom. One shot, one kill. Well, I'm more like a shotgun shot, really. We had the bubble spread. You know how it is. Uh, cheer up, Scatterbug! Oh, I wish we had a Scatterbug. Uh, oh, well. I didn't even get hit, I don't think. Don't worry, Sean. I'm good. I'm good. I'm good. I'm good. I'm good. Doodle doo. Oh, there's the scatter bug. See, we could it could have been us. It could have been us. But no. Level two. Not even not even worth our time, Scatterbug. Get away. Do, 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 do. Here we go, Tierno. Running around back there. Let's see. What else do we got? Do you go through this forest pretty quick? What's it gonna be? Caterpie. Godar. I would stick around except everything in this forest seems so weak so far. I'm not, it's like, uh, it doesn't even feel 
like we should be wasting time on it. I think there's little trainers up ahead we could fight. That would be more fun and a little bit faster. Ugh. What is it? Just more reminders of what we might have gotten. Yep, more scatter bugs we didn't catch. It's okay. It's okay. That's like the big uh, Vivalana thing is like the uh, the big challenge of the first gym. That's like the the Pokemon you have to beat. They use uh, like bug infestation or something. Do you have any Pokeballs? I sure do. You gave me a bunch. Hey, fight! Hey, hey, girl, fight me. Let's go. Bring it. I've got a frog that can shoot bubbles. What have you got? Oh no. I don't like this at all. This is bad news. Is she gonna have Thundershock? Oh gosh, this could be bad. It's level five. I bet it does have Thundershock. Oh dear. Maybe we should try and poison it. Now I feel like suddenly we're in a bad position. I don't like it. Let's string shot it right away. Just try and see what kind of moves it has. See if it has Thundershock, that didn't do very much. String shot go, cool. Maybe we can poison it, that would be great. I don't wanna, I, oh man, I'm nervous. What if she hits us with a Thundershock onto Axe? That would probably be pretty bad. Poison it, oh my God. We cannot kill it unless we poison it. Certainly not with, <laughs> not with Dar anyway. Aren't you just gonna like quick attack me or something now? It's gotta have some sort of offensive move. There it is, it does have Thundershock, oh no. Okay, we lived that pretty good. Okay, this is nerve-wracking. Poison! Yay, we poisoned it. Okay, that looks like, I bet the poison is more damage than the actual. Um. Oh no! What? Just like that? No, no, no. Oh, we've already lost someone. This is so bad. <laughs> it's like, it's the earliest we've ever, this is the second episode. This has never happened. And Thundershock can basically kill both of these things. How, how we found ourselves in such a position so early? Oh no, oh no, oh no, oh no, oh no. Okay, 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 it's bad news. It's bad situation. We have to quick, all we can do is quick attack this thing. We have to hope we are simply stronger. Go, go, go. The poison must kill. We must, oh, what happened? No, I'm so sorry. Oh, static, I'm paralyzed. Oh no, oh, it's bad. Things are looking bad, oh, use growl. Okay, okay, as long as, <laughs> oh my goodness. As long, I'm sorry, that mouse cursor has been there the whole time, hasn't it? That's probably been driving some people crazy. Okay, as long as we don't get paralyzed and we land the quick attack, we'll be okay. Right, here we go, here we go. Quick attack, boom. Oh, we lived a terrible, oh, it was so bad. Well, way to go. Axe in 120, level nine, super dupes. Oh, almost two levels, that's fantastic. Shauna, I need healing. Okay, so this is gonna be a weird situation where, um, hey, not just anyone could find a Pikachu, you know. Um, yes, they can. Yes, heal. So this is a weird situation where, oh my gosh, I cannot believe it, Dar! We barely knew ye! Uh, so Dar is dead. Um, we need to switch so he doesn't get sent out. It's a weird situation, even though it has full health, that's just because Sean is here. Dar is dead. Don't look at him. Sorry. Uh, maybe we should train up Tarth a little, though. Jeez, my goodness. Um, let's do that. Let's get, oh. Uh, Freaking, I can't believe that. I cannot believe we've already had someone die. Those early game Pikachus, that's what it is. All right, Fletchling. Ugh, so embarrassing. I'm sorry, you guys, but you immediately see the danger, right? Some of you might have already been feeling a connection to young Dar, but there he went. An early death. That's probably what we're gonna call this episode. An early death. There you go. Ugh, so terrible. Go, bubble this thing. Kill it. We need levels. We need to be better prepared. Tackle, dead, what time is it? Okay. Yeah, quick attack, die, fletchling. Bruh. There it is. There it is. My goodness. Someone's already died. We've only caught two Pokemon. Ah. Yeah, yeah, you'll heal our Pokemon whenever you want me to. 
We're gonna get Tarth to at least level five, I think. I think that's when Tarth gets guessed. Oh, it's a Panseer, yay! This this is what we want to fight. This is what we want to run into because they are gonna give us more experience and we have a type advantage. That's what we like. <clears throat> Let's go, Bubbles. Wouldn't have been funny if we ran into the uh, Pan Sage though because we had uh, Zaf in the last playthrough. Zaf was our, was our Pan Sage. Zafino, I think, was his full name, but we called him Zaf for short, you know. Boom, yeah, dead. See you later, pants here. Don't leave your pants here. <laughs> Those are words that sound the same. Lick. Uh, yes. I don't think we need pound and quick attack, right? Because pound is 40 and 100. And that's 40 and 100, except it's <laughs> fast. So let's get rid of pound. <laughs> And now we have a ghost type move real early on. That's cool. I think and a paralyzing move. Lick paralyzes, I believe. Tarth to level four. Yay, Tarth. Well, if we get Tarth to level five, we could probably knock out some of these bugs relatively quickly. That would be good. That would be good. Hey, right, did we kill everything in this patch of grass already? What's going on? All right, that's what I thought. Let's fight something. Bring it on. A Caterpie! All right, we're just gonna have Tarth kill this thing, regardless of uh, its level two-ness. Die! String shot? I don't think so. If we're actually slower than that thing now, that's gonna be real lame. Real lame. Yeah, we are, look at that. It was lame. You shouldn't be able to be slower than a level two Caterpie at any point for any reason, I don't think. I think that should be a rule. That's what I think. Please get the level. Yeah, it was worth it. All right, level five. And Tarth learned Gust, right? Sand attack. Ugh. <laughs> That's not Gust. It's not bad, but it's not Gust. All right, let's go fight this girl. You fight? You fight. Hey, the best part of Pokemon is that it can happen anytime, with anyone, with anywhere. With anywhere? Words are easy. Last lie said now. We do. Go, Tarth! Watch, guarantee you Tarth gets poisoned. Quickly and swiftly. Ready? Tackle. The computer... Oh! Never mind. The critical hit. Well done, Tarth. Well done. Ah, 16. Pretty good. Hmm? Hmm? Bunnelby? Bunnelby! I feel like if you did sand attack at Bunnelby, it would only really power it up because it looks so dirty anyway. Oh, I'm so scared of you leering at me. Kaboom! Yeah, Tarth! You show him what's up. Alright, Tarth. Definitely better than Dar was. Oh, look at that! Two fights, two levels. What's up? That's nice. Here we go. You defeated Last Lies. Yeah! Lisa? Liza? Lies? Oh. I think it's spelled wrong. Pokeball! Yay! You know what I think we need to do is go to options and go to text speed and go to fast and go to... Oh god, I just changed a bunch of things. I don't know what I did. Default. There we go. Confirm. Cool. Great. <laughs> I think go faster. And, ooh, an item. Found a potion. All right, let's get out of this forest. Let's do that, hmm? Hmm? Should we get out of this forest? You, oh, and now everyone's gonna have a little group powwow. So you're the first to arrive. Looks like my new neighbor is someone with a lot of potential. Are we gonna fight? I don't wanna fight you yet. Oh, the way Pokemon move is just incredible. No one should have the spear when I dance. It is funny how like all of his Pokemon, whenever you fight him, they'll all have like dance moves like swords dance. But well, that might be the only one. There's gotta be others. It's interesting how they theme them. Hmm. To put it in another way. <laughs> okay. Thank you for we don't need you to put it in another way. That's really condescending, small child. Like uh we understood you the first time. We don't need things explained to us. 
Oh man, I don't need I don't need to know your adventure rules. Don't need them. Don't care. <clears throat> oh, this is great, great. Mm-hmm. Here we go. All right, so now we're on Route Three, which means we can catch a new Pokemon. This is excellent. All right, there's little tiny trainer butts here. Hey. Mommy told me I should battle anyone who greets me. I didn't greet you. I stared you in the eyes. Oh, look at this cool backpack. Oh, preschooler Oliver said, oh, Caterpie. <laughs> Go Caterpie. As if I didn't just own a Weedle, but it died. So this guy's doing better than I did. No, that's not even true. Your Caterpie's only level two. I'd like to see you get up. Oh, no, didn't make it past level two. It's dead now. Sorry. Mm-hmm. Azurel. Oh my gosh. If we catch an Azurel on this grass, mm, if that's around here, that's going to be so lame. Splash. Boy. Pulling out the big guns, huh? There you go. Knocked out your Pokemon. Go run home to mommy. Tarth grew to level 7. Yeah, Tarth. Flying up them charts. Yo! Tell you what. Every time I catch a, a Pidgey, it's always a female, and I'm always upset that I caught it, and then they're always these super proud Pokemon that are like, oh, they're just very strong. All right, here we go. Route three. Pokemon, what's it going to be? <gasps> Something cool? Nah. No? Okay, so this is a great example of the uh, duplicate claws in effect. So, as you know, we already have Tarth. Uh, she's fighting right now. She's going to knock out this Pidgey. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Yes, Tarth, you're way stronger than that, Pidgey. Indeed. Kaboom. There it is. Yes. Yay. 28 points for us. So, but because we already caught a Pidgey, that does not count towards our first encounter. So, let's see what our first encounter will really be. It's gonna be a Fletchling. Okay, cool. So, well, now we have two bird types on the team, so there's that. Well, we haven't caught this yet, but let's see. I'm not thinking it's gonna be too terribly difficult. Do, 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 tackle. Yep, there it is. Mm-hmm, use tackle. Yep, okay. Now we're just gonna go bag, and we're going to go last use item, use. Use the Pokeball, yeah, boom. Here we go, mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Oh, gosh, I got it. That's the second time, like, I have to, got to change the settings. <laughs> like, something exciting was about to happen, and it faded out on me. I'm sorry about that. Or I should just remember to scooch the mouse around some there. Oh, so we need a, uh, we need a name. We need a name. Here we go. Let's see. Yes, we're going to name you... Tom John. <laughs> Your name is Tom John. <laughs> okay, uh, this is uh, one of our one of our patrons' name is uh, uh, Tom, but the account he logs in to on his Xbox is has for whatever reason I think it's his brother's and it's John, so <laughs> we just always call him Tom John. And there you go, that is uh, that's Fletchling. Welcome to the team, Fletchling. Uh, Fletchling is not bad. I like that. I like that catch a lot. Um, that's a fire type anyway. We can have that covered. Excuse me. Let's see. Ooh, Tom John needs a little bit of a potion. Let's go. Let's at least get to town. Let's do that. Hello. What have you got? Did you say Pikachu? Pichu. Okay. Less dangerous. Right now, yeah, we are, have a severe weakness to electricity on this team, though, and that's not good. Let's go ahead and just, we're just gonna try and knock you out real quick. Oh, it didn't quite get there, and I'm paralyzed. Oh, gosh. Oh, no. Oh, no. Okay. Okay. That's cool. That's fine. Everything's fine. We're gonna switch to Axe. Gosh, we run into these. You can't, you sh like, this should not be a threatening fight in any capacity at all, and yet here we are. Okay. Fortunately, Axe can take it. We're just gonna quick attack this thing and be done with it. <sighs> it's like, oh no, a oh, little preschooler, oh my god. Oh my god, she's got something electric, run! <clears throat> Excuse me. 
did we lose? You did lose, but you put me through my paces, little girl. Those thunder shocks were well placed, well done, good fight. Um, let's go ahead and where's our? Uh, we're gonna potion Tarth and paralyze heal Tarth. There we go, just in case. Can't be, can't be risking it out here. Let's look at uh, Tom John real quick. Tom John. Tom John. More, probably more of a high pitch little like Tom John, like that. Yeah. What do we got here? Are you gonna be an awesome addition? Growl and tackle. So, okay. And your hardy, hmm, sturdy body. And what do you have? Big pecs. Okay. Duh. So we can't have attack lowered. That's, I guess, nice. I guess you come across a lot of growls. You might get a lot of free turns here. Oh God, coming through. All right, see ya, skater girl. Let's keep going with Tarth, I guess. Hey, my Pokemon and I are studying. Want to join us? I mean, I'll fight you if that's what you mean. Bidoof. Oh, God, Bidoof. Ah. You guys know how much we don't like Bidoofs. I mean, they were like our total enemy for an entire game, I think, back in Pearl. Here we go. Tackle. I really want Tarth to get Gust. I feel like that's going to be... Oh, pretty strong tackle from that Bidoof. Uh, this is like this is like one of those where, like, obviously we're stronger, but if they got a crit there, we would have died. That would have been terrible. Really terrible. There we go, 63. Bam! Oh, yeah. Yeah, okay. There we go. Let's switch... Um... Tom John to the front. See some battle. By battle, I mean I'm going to immediately switch out of whoever we fight. Super potion, and we're just gonna let uh, Axe handle it. Here we go. The best way to learn about a move is to have your Pokemon use it. Well, that's true. Can't argue with that. Schoolboy Brighton, Pan Sage. Oh no! Look at this. What was we? What were we afraid of? Exactly this. Uh, why didn't? I, why was I too proud to heal? Why was I too proud to heal? Obviously, you can't fight. Um, Axe, get out there. So it doesn't really matter. He's level three. So even if he has Vine Whip, I'm not too worried about it. But I almost doubt. My attack fell. Bubble. Oh, you know what I seem to have toggled off was the battle animation somehow. Why am I using bubble? That was really bad. I should have just been quick attacking. Okay, well. Oh, oh, he's got this too. Well, this is gonna be an easy fight. Bubbles! Go, bubbles! Yeah! Is he gonna have the third one too? Or is that it? Do you have Panpour? Oh, he does. He's got them all. Look at him. This guy, like, spent some time in that forest. Good for you. Didn't level anything up, but all the same. I guess they have lowered my attack a little bit. Do 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 do. Quick attack. Mm hmm. Let's try Lick. You know, the best way to learn about a Pokemon is use it. Move is by using it. That's what one schoolboy taught me once. Level 11. Yeah, axe. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm, mm-hmm. Yeah, that move packs so much punch. It sure does. Licking stuff is always smart. Let's go. Well, no. Options, battle stuff, battle effects. All right, there we go. Confirm. Must have been pretty boring battles to watch you guys. Sorry, why didn't anyone tell me? Can I fight you? Yeah. Okay, we made it! Hooray! Pokemon Center. Thankfully, no one had to explain to me what a Pokemon Center was. Oh, never mind. Oh, hey there! We're you getting your Pokemon Heal too? Pokemon Center sure are great. You could talk to the lady at the counter. Yeah, I was about to, and then you interrupted me. Uh, yeah, killer dance moves, bro. That's Pokemon at the back of Pokemon Center. It's gonna just suck up Pokemon's push stuff to Pokemon. All right, see ya. Later, bye. Okay, first things first. Heal my Pokemon. 
Yay! All right, we have just two birds and a frog. Hanging out down by the bog. Nope. Uh, deposit Pokemon, I guess. Uh, well, Dar, we barely knew ye, but you died early. Sorry about that. I hope you have a good time in the afterlife. You were an early death. Hopefully we just got that out of the way. We don't have to worry about it ever again for the rest of the game. Everyone will be fine. See ya. Bye. Yes. Uh, sorry, Dar. Okay. Well, there it is. That's just how that's how the Nuzlocke goes. Uh, see, and that, that was that hard, and we barely even knew Dar. Imagine, like, ten episodes from now, when you're best friends with Tarth, or Tom John, or Axe. Oh, it's gonna be, it could be bad. It could get bad. Hopefully that's not gonna happen. Everyone's gonna do their best to stay alive as long as possible. And, uh, yeah. So, next episode, I think we're gonna try and take down the first gym. Uh, I think there is another little route we can go find a few more trainers on, make sure we're all nice and prepared for such a thing. And uh, thank you guys so much for watching. Uh, make sure you leave a comment down below and hit that like button. Uh, we name uh, Pokemon after people in the comments, so that is the best way to get a Pokemon named after you. Save your adventure so far, yes, yay, power. Uh, I know you might have heard me mention the Patreon if you want to support us there. It's patreon.com slash supercarlandgaming. Uh, we do uh, cool patches and you can even play uh, games with Ben and I once a month. That's super fun too. Um, but feel free to go check it out. Otherwise, I'll see you next time. Bye! Boom dead, ha. Huh?